You ever wonder what this map of the keep on the borderlands would look like at 150% scale? Well, I'm going to show you today on Crafting Times. So here's the map of the Keep on the Borderlands. After doing a little bit of number crunching and math, converting the 1970s scale to more modern one inch based war game and RPG one inch based pieces, I multiplied the representations from uh, 10 foot to be closer to uh, 15 foot. So, uh, Here's how big this thing is going to look when completed. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you the cutting pattern for the Keep on the Borderlands. I'm going to need a bigger house. Gate and drawbridge over there. And here we have horse stables, in jewel merchants, all these uh, other things all along the whole way. We have walls, battlements. Now we have the inner keep. And uh, more horse stables over there, jousting area somewhere in here, the whole thing. Well, now let me show you this. This is how you can tell how giant this is. Here. Is a little Pathfinder pawn figure next to a fountain. Here's how big this whole thing is gonna be. I can't even get it in the shot. Let me try and go up the stairs a little ways. You get the idea, folks. Down there. <clears throat> so anybody has a really big house. A lot of tables. Let me know. We're gonna start with number one, the gatehouse. Move to two. I think I'll do the walls last because it's all the same. Do the individual areas so that's what you can look forward to in the B2 build. One last gander at it when we go from the other side. There it is. And again. Here's how big a figure is. Alright, got a lot of work to do. Talk to you soon, everybody. Mm -hmm.